Oils have long been used as coolants and lubricants when drilling. This helps in lengthening the length of your drill bits, but also ensures that you get a clean cut. So today I decided to put to test these five products and see how they perform against each other and I'll reveal which is the best one that I saw fit to use. So I'm using lawnmower oil, brake fluid, dirty engine oil, Vaseline, and also I'm using cooking oil. So enjoy the video and I'll be uh, analyzing all of this at the end of the video. So I ensured that I was using new drill bits which I went ahead and installed one in my drill. And what you want to do if you're drilling on a metal bar or plate, first start by marking out the points that you want to drill. And then you're going to use a steel nail or a center, center nail just to hammer a hole so that when you're drilling, your drill bit has a starting point and it doesn't dance around the piece of metal that you are going to drill. So I did that with all of them. So begin by drilling through a few seconds and then the first one that we're going to add is cooking oil and then go ahead and drill. And as you can see, it aids in the drilling process. And then the next fluid that we're going to use is lawn mower oil. So we're going to repeat the same process by drilling through a few seconds. This is to give way to the metal that you're drilling. And then we're going to add the lawn mower oil. Remember, this also helps in cooling the metal base and the drill bit that you're using and also to act as a lubricant. So the next one, you again repeat the same process and then we're going to add um, brake fluid. So brake fluid is known to cut through rust or on, and, and also to cut through metal to a certain extent. So also that aids in our drilling. And remember, I'm going to be analyzing all this and seeing and saying which ones I found to be most efficient and which ones I found to be a little bit slow. On to the fourth one, we're going to use dirty engine oil. This type of oil is available in most places because it's discarded by so many people that own cars or mechanics. So it's readily available and cheap. Um, it also works fine. The only disadvantage with this one is that it somehow dirtifies your surface uh, a little bit. Um, and then now to the final one that I was so um, interested in knowing whether it works, Vaseline. Vaseline acts like a, it's, it's a little bit greasy, so it's different from the others that we have been using so far. And what I noticed with Vaseline is that as you're drilling, it kind of, uh, the pieces that you're drilling uh, attach to the, to the greasy substance. I don't know if that's good or bad, but that's the five that I used. And the best oil that I used, I can say it's lawn mower oil. Lawn mower oil is very good and it cuts through easy, but I can also say all the others worked well. And even if you don't have all this, you can use water because so long as you have a cooling substance. Thank you so much for watching my video. My hope is that you will consider subscribing and also clicking on that bell icon so that you don't miss any other video that I do. I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye.